Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Audrey, the Travel Mama. Today's topic is all about Hoya Trellis. Not all my Hoyas are on trellis, just like this fishtail or Hoya Bella. They are totally fun growing as a hanging basket. Sometimes you need trellis to help you saving some space on your counter. So I use trellis to help my Hoya growing vertically so they can take less space on my counter. Also trellis can help you to prevent the accident that happened on the Hoya seam. If I have this Hoya growing on trellis, I wouldn't have two cutting in this part at this moment. Now, let's talk about different types of trellis I'm using on my Hoya. The first, you can buy trellis online. I bought this one online and I really love it. It's a different element and elegance to my Hoya collection. But I do have a problem with this trellis, let me show you. It's such a big trellis that none of my Hoya can use this trellis at this moment. So if you want to buy a trellis online, make sure to check on the dimensions so that your Hoya can really use this trellis instead of playing a waiting game. The second type of Hoya trellis I'm using is totally DIY. My husband bought this wire for something else, but I used it on my Hoya for trellis. I can bend this wire into different shapes as you can see, it's such a flexible wire. You are totally flexible with different shapes of trellis that you wanted to create it for your Hoya. I use a U shape and then a round shape. U shape, you just bend the wire into a U. And then for the round shape, I kind of round it the center of the uh, trellis and then wrap the rope on them to add elements and textures, even colors into my trellis. The next trellis I'm going to show you guys is also a DIY. I have those bamboo sticks in my gardens for vegetables and flowers, but I also can use this on my Hoya. As you can see, I just cut the bamboos into different, different lengths. I have a two longer lengths of bamboo stick and then three shorter lengths. I hot glue them together and wrap the rope on them to make this trellis. This trellis is also very flexible. As you can see, I have two trellis, the same way I'm making them, but the length of the bamboo stick and the distance between the bamboo stick really make them look totally different. So you can adjust the size of the trellis based on your need. The next Hoya trellis I'm gonna show you is also DIY. I use it in my vegetable garden. You can use different materials for this trellis as a bamboo, the wire that I mentioned before, some driftwood, or some stick that you found it in your backyard that is totally dry. What you need to do is just to put the three sticks together, let them support each other, and use the rope on the top to tie them up. So you stick them into your pot and let the whole yard growing just wrapped around this trellis. It's a such an easy trellis and so many different ways you can make it. Those are my ideas for my whole yard trellis. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have other ideas, please leave a comment down below so we all can share. You all have a fabulous day. I'll see you next time. Bye.